Good afternoon and welcome to today's game. Today. Game day number four, Group H action. What a matchup this was. Two teams that are in the bottom portion of Group H right now. Belfast trying to get revenge after they lost their first game of CHL play to Otsalarte Trinets. Here in the opening period, a couple of minutes in, it was a tale of two goaltenders in this one as Andre Kazatel able to make an initial stop there to start things. But then the wrist shot from out near the blue line finds the back of the net as Will Cullen off the faceoff makes it one nothing Belfast. Trinets trying to answer, but Peyton Jones had a terrific game in goal for Belfast. Belfast off the turnover. They got a breakaway opportunity here. Scott Conway just pushes that one a little bit wide of the net that time and an opportunity to make it two to nothing, but Conway unable to capitalize on it. Power play here for Belfast here in the second period and a power play goal. They went to go review it, make sure there wasn't any interference, and this time Scott Conway able to bury it to make it two to nothing. Belfast. And then how about this? Peyton Jones, terrific. Did not give up any goals for the first two periods. But Trinets trying to change that. Jones with a terrific save here to start the third period, sliding to his left to make that initial stop. But Otsalarce Trinets able to answer here in the third to cut the lead in half to 2-1 to one as Peter Verana makes it 2-1. to one. Belfast trying to respond, though. They have a two-on-one as Kazatel able to make a save as charging to the net was Tyler Soy and just pushed it wide on the backhand attempt that time. Late stages, third period. Trinet still trailing by a goal, but not for long. They kept chipping away and chipping away, and the puck popped free and onto the stick of Thomas Marchenko as Marchenko able to tie it at two. And then a power play opportunity. It was the man advantage for Trinets in the late stages of the third period. That Peyton Jones keeping the puck out of the back of the net. We go to overtime. Still on the power play after the major penalty to end the third period. And Peyton Jones still keeping the puck out of the back of the net as Trinets had plenty of chances in overtime. It would go to a shootout. Here in the first round of the shootout, it is Cooper able to get the puck past Kazaktel and then trying to respond. Hudacek has the door slammed by Peyton Jones. Jones was the star of the night for Belfast to give them their first win of the CHL season in a shootout as Belfast wins three to two.